what is going on, everybody? My name is Wolfwinger, ladies and gentlemen. I am joined by Mr. Gamer55561 for a brand new episode of Camp Quest. First and foremost, we want to thank you guys for the amazing support on the series so far. You guys have been incredible with your amazing, Whoops. amazing... What? Nothing. What? Nothing. What? Don't worry about it. Who says oops? You're freaking me out, dude. Oops, what? 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 Okay. Oops, I hit you. Oops, I did it again. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were going to do that. Uh, nonetheless, ladies and gents, of course, uh, as I said, thank you for the support. You guys are incredible. Once again, drop a like on this video. And also, of course, we hope that you guys enjoy the series of Camp Quest. Stick around because there will be another spooky story today. And first and foremost, gamer, we got to address something because there's a little bit of controversy in the last episode. And that was that, hey, gamer's not supposed to be able to craft flint and steel. So, well, in my defense, okay, in my defense, okay, you told me to craft it, you gave me all the materials, oh, wow. and you really? didn't notice as well. Real, okay, but I'm keeping track of my stuff. Like, I told you, like, hey, make me a, a pickaxe, and could you please make me a sword, and blah, blah, blah. So it's like, what are you trying to say? Oh, Blitz, you should just keep track of everything. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't want to have any responsibility at all, so Blitz, you take <laughs> care of everything. That's the excuse. Yeah, pretty but, much. Ladies and gentlemen, we have got a punishment assembled. So first and foremost, gamer, you will be placed with another limitation on you for not being able to craft stuff. So are you that ready to find out? That was a sentence you formed so far. <laughs> what? What do you mean? You're going to be another placed with another limitation on you of not being able to no, craft No, it's just something. the way you said it because you said it with pauses in between. So I was like, uh, Oh, because okay. cause I don't know why. I thought that I was like, because of the clouds, like whenever the clouds come up here, like when I jumped up, I was like, whoa, did I just jump too far? And I got to fly off this cliff. <laughs> so I like pause to like double take if I'm going too far. Uh, but essentially what you will not be able to craft from now on, additionally to the previous three items, which were. Oh, uh, flint and steel, bed okay. and chest plate. All right. So now, on top of that, you will not be able to craft a axe. So you are not allowed to craft axes as well. Okay. Now, if you're like tuning in for the very first time to Camp Quest, and you're like, "What are you talking about? Not allowed to craft?" We have placed limitations on one another of three things. Now, gamer actually has four things that he's not allowed to craft. So for me, for uh, for example, I'm not allowed to craft swords. I'm not allowed to craft uh, pickaxes or furnaces. So those are three items that, if I want, like for example, the way that I have this stone sword is because I asked gamer to craft one for me, and he did. So if I want a pickaxe, a sword, or a furnace, I got to turn to gamer to make that stuff for me. Now. On top of all that, there is another limitation that is uh, placed on both of us, and that is that we are not allowed to carry any more items than what we can carry on our person. So this is the inventory that is available to us, and there is not any more that is available. And last, but certainly not least, Gamer, your punishment, dude. Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. So what you have to do is you have to figure out how to jump from here down into the water, and uh, yeah, good luck with that. You do that. Okay, so give me a few years to figure out how to make a flying yeah. device in I mean, look, Minecraft. Like, <laughs> this seems pretty reasonable. So <laughs> at first we thought that this would be hilarious, like as an actual placement, <laughs> but then I realized like, yeah, there's no way you could actually make that jump. So instead what Gamer is gonna have to do is actually try to land into that puddle from this rock right up here. You can't go that far down, dude. You gotta oh, try from know. up okay. here. From where? From this ledge right here. This um, one. Okay, So you gotta enough. try to land into water and Am I allowed a running start? Uh, of course, yeah. You can okay. take as long of a running start as you jump off the other <laughs> end. You're like, I'm just going to run all the way down and just start from there. <laughs> okay. So you have to make this jump. Now I will count down, and then you can go ahead and run towards it and attempt oh, to deliver okay. your jump. You know. Now, here's the key element. If you miss, whatever items fall off of you right now, you can't pick those up. Come on, I, I wasn't told this. You gotta, that's the punishment part. If you miss and you just go back down and pick it up, what's the punishment, right? If you make it, you get to this keep is, everything. Okay, but this is the only thing I'm going to give to you then. Okay, sure, I'll carry just, it. There we go. Just the, just yeah. the iron, that's okay. the most important. Okay. okay, all right, that sounds fair. Ooh, dude, I'm nervous for you. All right, oh, here we go. Okay. All right, are you ready, dude? I'm like genuine. I want you to make it because like we're on the same team, so I do want you to make this jump. Okay, cool. All right, are you ready? Whew, okay, I'm ready. three. Wait, let me get a good shot so I could see you flying. Three, two, one, go, gamer, go. There he goes. Oh no, I'm not gonna make it! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh. 
halfway oh. through the fall, I was like, oh, at the top, I was that so was confident. Hilarious. And that then halfway so through, funny. I realized I wasn't going to make it. And then I'm just like, oh, no. Oh, my gosh, dude. You know what? That was funny because you were literally like still midair. And then you just said, I'm not going to make it. And then your body just like <laughs> bounces off the rock. It was like midway through the sentence, your body hit the actual thing. So, oh, my gosh, that was so, so funny. All right. Okay. So now what we need to do is regroup. So let me uh, get Gamer back to the uh, team here. That, okay, that was pretty funny. That uh, was pretty funny. TP, uh, it's your name, then space, two. Your name. Do I do two or just my name? No, just just space. Okay. There we go. There we go. All right, dude. So we uh, got to get you some items. Yeah. The other things we're focused on today's episode is actually food. hunting for some food because that would be yeah. very, very, very nice to have some more of. So we're going to do a little bit of hunting and gathering. And then last but certainly not least, the number one goal is by the end of today's episode, we need to have two beds. Can so I, for that, we need to find some sheep. What? Can I use your axe? You, you have uh, one, right? Yes, you can have I this see, axe right faster. here. Here you go, sir. Whoops. Mm -hmm. uh, left, right down here. It's right in that. There we go. Can you see it? All right, sweet. Yeah, I got it. Dude, I'm going to collect some of this... Uh, melon. Uh, watermelon, okay? Because okay. watermelon's awesome. Of course. Watermelon. I love watermelon. Ooh, yeah, look watermelon at all these cows, awesome. too. So if we... Uh, we could actually probably grab some of these cows. Sorry, cows. Probably a good idea. It had to be done. Look, I, I always feel like Minecraft should have, like, some sort of a sneak mode for, like, hunting where you could just, like, boot him. Well, yeah, put that's him, put him. what the shift is put for. Him, put him, put him. No, I know, but what I mean is like it doesn't make a difference if I run up to the cow or walk up to. Oh, okay. True. Well, I've can just you give me? Um, <laughs> the cow's you... just looking at me like, dude, I see you. Like, what are you trying to do? <laughs> you know what's uh, also a problem? I'm a big giant red robot. It's yeah. like, I'm not blending in anywhere in the jungle, no matter how hard I try. What's yeah, up? I mean, I no. <laughs> you you'll blend nope. in better because you've got a little bit of a checker pattern on your shirt and everything so you don't see me i don't know what you're talking about yeah the red shirt definitely is a bit <laughs> of a giveaway but hey you've got um, green uh headphones so there you go true <laughs> your true. ears will blend in <laughs> <laughs> dude that guy has no ears what do you need uh cobblestone if you have uh any. yes here you go sir you may have some of that cobblestone all right so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna just scout around here so try not to like go too far away uh, while you reestablish your items, here. because I'm just looking for sheep. Okay, I don't know. I do they even spawn in this biome? Sheep? Um, mm. I'm pretty sure they sp wherever there's grass, you can they can oh, spawn. Oh yeah. Oh, but okay, I think okay, we should good. go into that biome over there on the left hand side. Yeah, it's yeah. gonna be nighttime soon. I'll follow you in just a moment here. All right, so I am right on soon. your tracks. Where are you? Where? Okay, I was right on. Oh, the, what the no. heck? What are you, Flash? Dude, what uh, are we dealing with here? She's gonna blow my cover. Uh, I don't think you're Flash. You might be. You might be a little, a little someone known as Zoom. I don't know who that is. <laughs> please, please. I love uh, this voice. Please come again. Zoom's voice was like amazing in Flash. Remember that? Yeah, it was. It, wait, the, sh uh, the TV show, right? Yeah, yeah. terrifying. Yeah. So uh, crazy. Yeah, it, it was great. It was honestly <gasps> great. I'm so excited. Sheep spotted. I'm Told going you. for it. Was yeah. I was I right or was oh, oh, I right? Please. Oh, sorry. I thought Where I was gonna you? fail as well. I thought I was Where gonna land on the. I just went like right ahead. Uh, I don't know how to Where's say that any better. Uh, turn left. No, left. What? Uh, go, mm. go towards the ledge. Uh, oh, keep running. Okay. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. yeah. More, more, more. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, right you. here. Big giant red robot. I see you. I, yeah. Big giant red robot. <laughs> red robot. Red giant red, 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 red robot. Red robot. Red robot. Um, yeah, you don't, dude, I saw you like a mile away. You don't blend in with <laughs> I know, <anything>. yeah. <laughs> like, I could be surrounded by shrubs and they would still be like, oh, yeah, there's dude, you, <laughs> the, if, if Like, if I missed you, that just would have been embarrassing. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, man. I kind of wish we would have had uh, shears now. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, yeah. you have iron. Yeah, I just remember that literally right as I took out the last sheep. All right. By the way, you should probably smelt that. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm getting and, some, because you can't make a furnace, can you? Yeah, I'm not allowed to. And then okay. you need to cook some of this food. I've collected plenty of food, so okay, there's okay. lots so of So should we oh, ooh, set out that, camp over dude, here? Right um, yeah, you should do that. Yeah, that'll be Just good. Just get these I'm, pigs for now. So what I'm going to do is, uh, you, or I'll get, grab yeah, yeah, grab the pigs. I'm going to try to find some more sheep because we need yeah. two more sheep. I'll, I'll just make a mini camp thing over here, and we'll just camp out yeah, here for Yeah, and that's what we'll set up the night. Um, hmm, I'm not really seeing... Wow, okay. Any I'm so bad here. at it. I'm going to go this way. Maybe I'll find yeah. someone. Just don't, just don't lose where <gasps> okay, we are. Okay, Skellington, Skellington, Skellington. I'll fight him. I think I can take him. I can take him, bro. What up, bro? Ow! 
What's How could he okay? have such pinpoint accuracy at point blank? <laughs> at point blank? <laughs> yeah, I mean, honestly, he'd be terrible if he missed at that range. It's like, uh, uh, of course he wouldn't miss you. You, you would be, it, it would, you would be a god if you dodged at that range. Yeah, well, I would be Flash, probably. <laughs> yeah, you would. <laughs> or be Zoom, flash. honestly, True. with Whew. that kind of speed. Or the reverse uh, flash. Yeah, or Anyone, any of pretty them. much. One of the speedsters, yeah. basically. Uh, wait, why am I? I was about to use some wood for uh, uh, burning, oh. but I just saw some uh, coal. Oh, yeah, here we go. My goodness. All right. Cool. Oh, so we got some no. coal now. Oh, no. Yikes. Man, are these okay? spiders are, like, relentless. Are spiders, okay? like, really want you to become Spider-Man. I got to say. Yeah, they, they're, they're just, they're never going to give up. Yeah. They're but really... during the day, they're like, nah, we're, we're on our lunch break. Yeah, they're like, nah, we don't need no more Spider-Man <laughs> running around. <laughs> At nighttime, they're like, we got to get more Spider-Man. Come on. Our Spider-Man uh -huh. quota for the month has been low. Can you imagine if that's like actually something spiders do? Like they meet up during the daytime. They've got like a manager, uh, spider, uh, uh, uh. like Bob, the manager, who's just like, all right, guys, I got to tell you. That sounds a little like Jane and Jonah Jameson. J. Jonah Jameson from Spider-Man. I well, got to tell you guys. You got to you gotta hit the quota. We've got way too few Spider-Man running around. We need 10 more for this weekend. Like, I just okay, don't think okay. you'd be like, uh, what's his face saying that? He'd be like, <laughs> get those pesky spider man off the streets. Out, well, yeah, J. Jonah wouldn't want spider man <laughs> Yeah. would <laughs> be the opposite. But but doesn't it bring him business? So... Uh, yeah, that's why it never made sense. It was like one of those things like that, like m like many other businesses that are against stuff. Like, you know how like businesses would be like, hey, we're anti, I don't know, smoking or something like that. But it's mm -hmm. like, if everyone quits smoking tomorrow, you have no business. It makes yeah, no yeah, sense. Yeah. Of course you want people to do that stuff because it's like... That's how you're keeping your company alive. So yeah, I mean, it doesn't make sense, but you know, you gotta do whatever like, you gotta seems do. Seems like a or... little bit of a, a little bit of a mischievous lie. Okay, so I got a bunch of food. I have no idea where you. Uh, oh, there you are. Huh? I'm in trouble. Like, <laughs> I like I'm, look, dude. I, okay, I'm actually, I'm actually really in trouble, dude. Oh, okay. I actually need to help against that guy. Can you take uh, I'm like I'm like I don't know where you are. I turn around and see this big red robot on top of a mountain. I'm like, nope, never mind. Uh, Found you. Zombies attacking. You can take care of one, Dude, right? I, I'm I'm not sure. I'll try. Dude, I'm at two and a half hearts, okay? Me too. <laughs> Dude, that's oh crazy. God. We're literally at the same health. Okay. Oh, spider. Spider. Let's fight him together. Okay, dead. Okay. Can uh, we take build care of the zombie? Do you have more? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Take blocks? care of the zombie, though. Okay, I will. Just build out a house. Wait. Not with me outside, though. <laughs> You're like, done. I'm like, wait, no. <laughs> I'm out. See ya. That's not, that's, build no that's, doors or yeah. windows. <laughs> It's not what I meant. <laughs> All right, so we have a little bit of an issue here because I only have four no pieces sheep. of wool, and oh, I was not more. able to find any more sheep. Okay, well here for now, here, dude, eat this so we can at least uh, get get some health back. Yes, that is. Um, I have very more good. food. I just need to cook it up. So yeah. I'm at full heart. I mean, full health. I'm just regenerating uh, the hearts. Do I have any? Oh, I do have cobble. Uh, so wait, am I allowed? Yeah, I'm allowed to make an axe. Yeah, you're not allowed to make one. Okay, yeah, can cool. you make me one by the way? Yeah. Um, what's it called? I got shears for you if you want them. Okay. I can only make, by the way, um, a stone pickaxe. I mean, axe for you. Okay. Could That's you fine, possibly yeah. make me a stone sword? Because mine's literally about to break. I have. I actually made a second one okay. uh, for myself, but I can give it to you. All right. So I shall right. go ahead. Can I get some help? Can I get some help? I'm actually going to die. Uh, run to me. Oh, oh, oh Spider-Man. Spider-Man. Run to me. I'm becoming Spider-Man. Oh, you got an arrow on the knee. <laughs> Oi. Okay, there we go. Okay. Ooh, I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. Um, I'm running. I'm running. I'm running, I'm running. Okay, build up a house, <laughs> or at least just a wall, a little bit more. We can't extent. call it a house. It has to be. Yeah, a, I know. A just a, uh, a camp. A campsite. That's that's pretty much what it is. That's exactly what it is. Yeah. All right. So let me go ahead and craft two axes, really quick. Whoa! Did I just hear an Enderman? I think I just heard an Enderman. Well, right. as long as we don't hear, look at it, we'll be fine. Yeah, just don't look at him. Just do not look at okay. him. Um, All right. So far, so here's what, what else I, I cook. think we shall do, mm -hmm. since uh, we do not have all that much. Whoops. Can I? Do you think I could? Oh, no. Here you go, by the uh, way. What? Ooh, thank you. Ooh, iron sword. Sweet. Yep. Oh, yeah, because we had like 15 pieces of iron, didn't we? Yeah. That's nice. Dude, that's I'm gonna awesome. make us some pickaxes now. All right, actually, yeah. I'm gonna barricade this up so that we are not under the um, rain because we could get there. pneumonia, be all Here cold and stuff. There you go. I set up a little flame, and gamer, I think mm. what we shall do is uh, 
hear your story, sir. So what we shall do from now on, guys, is we decided it'll be a lot more exciting if we told one story per episode. So Gamer's going to tell a spooky story this time. I will tell a spooky story next time, and then we'll just take turns going uh, back and forth, setting it up like that. Because I think we'll it'll be more fun uh, because we felt like the pacing of the episode kind of slows down if we're both telling a story for a long time. Even though you guys really did enjoy it, which, oh my gosh, <gasps> sorry, sorry for panicking. He just snuck through. Dude, you hit me. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Dude. Well, it was an, okay. it's an iron sword. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's getting barricaded. <laughs> um, all right. So, gamer, you have a spooky story for us, don't you, sir? <laughs> Look at that. What? The zombie arms are just going through the block. <laughs> that's already spooky enough. You're like, there was a <laughs> story right, enough, though. See about two. Minecraft. Oh, this is actually gonna be pretty funny. Actually, no, no, no. Here we go. Okay. Okay. So we got some undead. Okay. Outside the uh, outside the door, and that's all. Okay. I'm wait, say. Wait, wait, okay. Where are you gonna stand? Ready? Where are you gonna stand? Because I want you standing right by the torches, so it looks kind of like epic, like the fires around you, kind of like you know how people put a little flashlight in front of their yeah. face when they're telling a scary story. All right. So like, yeah, if you can like press shift, so you're like kneeling down. Yeah, there we go. Okay. That's good. Ready? Yes. All right. Here we so go. This story is called "I'm Not Dead." Oh my gosh. Okay, so uh, let's start. Old man Jenkins was very sick, but he kept telling everyone there was nothing wrong with him. His wife was so worried that she sent for the doctor. Oh gosh. When the doctor arrived and tried to examine him, old man Jenkins protested saying, there's nothing wrong with me. Whoa. But okay. you're dying, the doctor said. It's not true, said old man Jenkins. You don't have a heartbeat, the doctor said. <laughs> I'm not dead said old man Jenkins, and he threw the doctor out of his house. The next day, old man Jenkins was dead. His wife called the undertaker, and when he arrived, he put the old man in the coffin and, dro and, drive, uh, and drive him down to the church. Drove him. I know, but here it says drive. Oh, well, you can correct uh, it. <laughs> and drive, driven him. <laughs> uh, they had a funeral, and then they carried him to the cemetery and buried him. The next morning, the policeman was on his way to work, when he passed the cemetery, he saw old man Jenkins sitting on the wall. I thought you passed away, the policeman said. <laughs> I'm not dead, old man Jenkins replied. The police went straight to old, old man Jenkins' house and told his wife, Your husband is sitting on the cemetery wall and he claims he is not dead. <laughs> I'll pay no attention to him, the old woman said, as he's dead as, oh, he's dead, as dead could be. The next day, the shopkeeper was on his way to work. When he passed the cemetery, he saw Old Man Jenkins sitting on the wall. Is that you? asked the shopkeeper. Oh, it gosh. is, Old Man Jenkins replied. I heard you were ill, said the shopkeeper. I was, Old Man Jenkins replied. And then I, and then I heard you died, said the shopkeeper. I'm not dead, Old Man Whoa. Jenkins replied. Okay. Didn't they bury you the other day, asked the shopkeeper. Do I look like I'm buried, Old Man Jenkins said. That much is true, said the shopkeeper as he walked off, scratching his head. The next day, the postman was cycling past the graveyard when he spotted Old Man Jenkin Jenkins sitting on the wall. What's the news? asked Old Man Jenkins. Not much news, said the postman, except I heard Old Man Jenkins died. It's not true, said Old Man Jenkins. <laughs> How do you know? asked the postman. <laughs> because I'm Old Man Jenkins, came the reply, and I'm not dead. Oh, said the postman, and he cycled away from the cemetery as fast as he could. I feel like it's almost like, and then he waddled away <laughs> to the very <laughs> next day. Ba, 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 da, ba, da, ba. Okay. Okay. He didn't stop cycling until he came to the nearest pub. He hopped off his bike, ran inside, and said, There's an old man sitting on the cemetery wall, and he claims he's Old Man Jenkins. That cannot be true, said the barman. Why not, asked the postman. Because Old Man Jenkins is dead, said the barman. Well, said the postman, maybe someone should tell him. This kept going on week after week, month after month, and the townsfolks were getting worried. Everyone knew that Old Man Jenkins was dead. Everyone, that is, except for Old Man Jenkins himself. He just, he just sat there on the cemetery wall, day after day, saying, <laughs> I'm not dead. And he, he got very angry when anyone contradicted him. He made t-shirts, buttons. <laughs> he's got like a whole marketing company. He's, like, he's got hats. <laughs> The townsfolk eventually had a meeting and decided that they uh, would put another, uh, hold another funeral. They dug another hole in the cemetery and put up another gravestone that inscripted, uh, the inscription on it read, Here lies the body of Old Man Jenkins, born 1901, died 2001. When Old Man Jenkins read the inscription on the stone, he couldn't believe his eyes. 
He read it over three or four times. After a long pause, he said, Well, maybe it's true. Maybe I am dead. With that, he hopped into the grave, covered himself with dirt, and he hasn't been seen or heard from since. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it took. <laughs> he had this like intricate, like he did all this like search engine optimization to prove that he's not dead. He's got hats, he made banners, he hired cheerleaders, he's got like the whole thing. And then once he sees the grave, he's like, huh. That is a pretty compelling argument. <laughs> <laughs> and then he just gives up. I love it. That was great. Uh. Ladies and gentlemen, speaking of great, we hope that you guys thought that today's episode of Camp Quest was great. We will, of course, catch you guys next time on the next episode as we continue to explore the wonderful, wonderful world in our camping series. We hope that you guys will tune in for another spooky story, another hopefully fun adventure. As always, have an absolutely fantastic day, guys. We'll see you guys later. Alligators. Bye-bye, everyone. Thanks all for watching.